we recognize changes is, you know, is inevitable. And we do see the future very differently. And the future we see is one that really requires us to be a value-based delivery system. And you'll ask, what does that mean? What value-based means, well, it's simple. It means that we put the patient in the center of everything we do. But it also means that we pay attention to what matters most to the patient, the outcomes that matter most to the patient, and we will deliver that service at less cost. That's our future. We call our model patient-centered medical home, or PCMH for short. PCMH is a framework to deliver primary care to the community using evidence-based medicine. It emphasizes the continuous delivery of high-quality preventive and chronic care to our members, taking into consideration delivery of care and cost containment. The PCMH model moves away from the episodic type of care that healthcare organizations have been providing over the years to a more coordinated, effective, efficient type of care with the patient and family as the center of our efforts. The PCMH model gives the power back to the patient to self-manage, to really take care. We hold their hands, but we make them understand that this is your health, what you say matters, and we're going to consider everything you say within when we're planning your care. However, self-management is so very important. Well, physician-driven, the physician is a leader, the leader of the team, the patient is a very important member of the team. That patient who comes see the physician, the physician may say, we need to have an eye doctor. You need to go to the ophthalmology clinic. But when you tell the patient ophthalmology clinic, sometime in, the, in our population, yeah, they hear you, but they don't know what you're talking about. We need a member of the team to be able to translate that. So what I do is I make sure that our patients are seen timely when they want to be seen. And I, um, coordinate the care. So if there's um, issues, like if the patient needs to be seen by a gynecologist, podiatrist, or maybe a urologist, we make sure th that care is coordinated so the patients are able to see those providers. Well, when we begin to see our patients come for their visits, come on time for their visits, and move away from saying, where's the doctor? Where's the nurse? Where's the PCT? To saying, where's my doctor? Where is my nurse? Where is my PCT? Then we know that we've officially become patient family centered and that they are part of our process. Very important things in PCMH. It's a patient advisory board where patients should come together and advise the ad advise administration what's working, what they would like to do, you know, what we could do better. It's a constant back and forth with the patient, making sure that the quality of care that we provided was exactly what they expected, what they needed, and what they wanted. My role is to enhance, you know, the flow of the patient care here at Kinsborough in making the specialty appointment, the lab work. Us as BAs, if we can help the patients besides going to the doctors and nurses, we try our best. And now instead of having the patients come back to do lab work, radiology, we try to get it done the same day instead of the back and forth. Because working as a team, it helps get the patient satisfied, make the patient happy, getting everything in order. And everybody working together, together. we will miss something because something you miss, the other person Somebody can come can and pick it up. We take the patient's culture into consideration, and that's why it's just... Um, it's just not patient-centered. It's patient and family-centered. It's the whole person. It's a very holistic way of providing care to the patient. 
for so long, patients have struggled with the ability to see their doctors, care being centered around the patients, the absence of a really good uh, educated consumer. Um, so PCMH for me brings to bear all of the facets that's necessary for good quality and consistent patient health care centered around the patient. So the entire team, uh, uh, in, instead of the patient coming to the team and having to navigate between all of the, the various components, as a team, we collaborate and we bring uh, almost a complete package um, ready for the patients. It's a family affair. That's the model of the PC image. Make the patient feel that he or she is not going to a place to, to f do any, anything else, but she's going home. It's patient center medical home. She's going home and to and at home, she's welcome at all time. And anything that needs to be taken care of is gonna be taken care of. When the patient feels more comfortable and the care is more manageable, I feel successful. They come in the door and they say, oh, there's my nurse. Oh, there's my doctor. They say they're so happy because we educate. We're on a personal level with our patients. It's a, it's a whole person orientation that we have with our patients. I'm not going nowhere else. Kingsbrook is my home. We got the nurses, the doctors, everybody are nice. For the number of years I've been here, I am, where I say, well satisfied oversatisfied with the treatment and care that I've been getting. We're certainly going beyond the patient-centered medical home model. We do need to reach out to our communities and to redouble our efforts in reaching them with health education. Our new community leadership council has really taken the lead in developing our best health school. It's a major initiative with a very structured curriculum and programs to reach all of our communities with health education, uh, awareness uh, for making healthy choices, all with the same objective, and that is to achieve improved outcomes that matter to our patients.